you know, you're even more exposed as someone who's open carrying. So you should make sure you have equipment that really supports the mission that you are doing and carries the gun in a mature and sophisticated way. Open carry can be a controversial topic for some, and before we get into the topic, what I want to make clear is uh, Tenacore is a strong supporter of the Second Amendment. You have the freedom to do what you like, and so if you want to exercise the Second Amendment in whatever way you believe is the right thing to do, you should do that. And I'm not at all saying don't do that. The problem with open carry isn't so much the concept of open carry, but it's more an equipment, right? There's a mindset to open carry, and then there's tactics and skills to open carry, and equipment to support that. And most private citizens that are trying to exercise their rights to open carry are not sophisticated enough to think about the, what might happen with their gun and have the proper training and equipment to support that. The challenge with open carry is that there's nothing standing between your gun and the person trying to take it away. And there are videos galore on the internet of people walking up behind people who are open carrying either in their pocket or in a holster that doesn't have retention and the person just snatches the gun out. Um, and we've done this in training and kind of demonstrated that. It's really simple and really easy to do uh, and is just frankly irresponsible. Equipment is really important. Having equipment that supports your tactics and skills is important. And if you are committed to open carry, equipment that is just an afterthought, equipment that is falling apart, equipment that is not supporting the gun, equipment that is not carrying the gun in an effective way, is not satisfactory. At Tenacor, often we talk about our customer being the professionally minded user. And that's not just someone who's paid to carry a gun, because there's some people who are paid to carry a gun that don't think about it in a professional way, but someone who is professionally minded in how they carry a gun and all in their mindset, tactics, and skills that support that. So for a professionally minded user, if you're gonna open carry, you're gonna carry with some sort of ret active retention device on the holster. And that concept is basically non-negotiable. So there should be some sort of thumb activated mechanical device that doesn't inhibit with the gripping of the gun that allows you to disengage the retention and then draw the gun. And then somebody who is not familiar with your holster is not going to be able to pull the gun out. One way to think through the open carry issue is just from a constitutional perspective. The person who is open carrying is trying to exercise their constitutional rights and make a statement, and that is within their prerogative. Another way to consider open carry isn't just are you doing it well, but should you do it or not. Some people will make the argument that if you open carry and there's a bad guy there, you are actually going to be the first target. And that might be true, but it also might not, um, and here's an argument for that. Most people are not very observant. Most people are hyper-focused on certain things and not broadly aware of what's going on. And the reality is you could open carry a gun into a Walmart or into a mall or wherever, and most people aren't even gonna know you have a gun. And the idea that the bad guy who is there to rob the place or do whatever is looking around and super observant versus he's stressed out and he's hyper-focused and has tunnel vision on his task, it's more likely that he is hyper-focused and tunnel-visioned on his task, and he's probably not even going to know that you're open carrying. So if you believe in open carry, then do that, right? Just do it intentionally and do it well. As a footnote to this whole conversation, my preference is concealed carry. I don't have no interest in people knowing who I am and what I have with me. My preference would be to blend in with people as best I can and then to have that element of surprise if a gun is needed.